Today is the opening for T.A. Brown Elementary. Two years, two months in the making. Welcome to T.A. Brown. Today is coming home for T.A. Brown. Today is an awesome, awesome day. It's unbelievable and it's, we're shining. We're, we're like, we, we can't even stop smiling. <laughs> we're so happy. So in 2016, November 3rd, 2016, I was called around five-ish, uh, asked to evacuate the school. AISD was forced to close the 10 acre campus right away just to protect students and teachers. I was actually part of uh, the team that had to move TA Brown and was involved with the assessments where we found the structural issues in the old building here and had to shutter the school overnight. We moved them over to Barrington Elementary. We set up a little portable village. Portables had cafeterias, gyms and classrooms, offices, just like you would in any normal school. We felt uh, empty. We felt like we were missing a part of us. TA Brown is one of 16 campuses that will either be rebuilt or updated depending on the results of a $1.05 billion bond election next month. TA Brown was at the top of the list for the 2017 bond program to be rebuilt and reestablished within the community. I think there were a couple of schools that were uh, trying for Rogers O'Brien. <laughs> I think we were competing. What stood out was their authenticity. It is about the relationships and the story that they told when they were in front of us, I could see that it was real. This is a sizable project. The constructability of it is pretty straightforward, but it's all of the different stakeholders that have a claim to it. You have the community, you have the district, you have the students that actually go here. It's not just the building itself, but it's everybody else that has a part in it. This is the first time that the district also entertained a design build delivery, and we were very fortunate to be able to identify a great design partner and visit with them and get to see that we align culturally and then we align with the vision of the district. This project in particular in the bond program was a pioneer in a lot of ways. Everyone needed to understand the vision and really own it and that's what Rogers O'Brien did. They did just that. It was early on in an owner's meeting when it was asked us how we were gonna engage with the community. And internally, we went through a couple of different iterations of what that might look like. And we eventually settled on YouTube videos. Today, we're gonna to talk about safety. What I really liked was the YouTube videos, that we were gonna be able to see the progress and the process, and being able to share it with the children was one of the, the highlights as well. And I tell Thomas that he's famous, so like we all want his autograph, and I did get it, so that was good. There's a lot from a design standpoint that sets this building apart. We didn't put a box in the middle of the site, demolish trees, and go, here's your school. The story of the building itself is an educational tool. These are open on purpose, so the students can see all the infrastructure, MEP, everything it takes to have a building function. The colors have meaning, the shape of the building has meaning. It focuses on the outdoor learning, sustainability, reducing the carbon footprint through the LED lighting, through automation control. One of the things that uh, is a reflection of our core values is giving back to our community and participating in our community. This school, it's a high profile project for the wrong reasons to start with, but it's gonna be a high profile project and well known for the right reasons. And so we're happy to be a part of bringing it back to this community for those children and for those families. From falling apart and dangerous for students to being a model for the district, T.A. Brown Elementary is back open today. RO was a part of building that trust with the district, building the trust with the community. So this whole process, we wouldn't have gotten to where we are without RO owning the vision with us and without them building that trust with us. It means a lot. I feel very, very fortunate to be part of something bigger than what I could have done on my own. Very fortunate.